So you might notice, or maybe not, the angle on the camera is a little bit different today. And that's because the rest of the office is kind of like a mess. There's a random shelf that's not even built in the middle of the room. And that is because today, what I've been trying to do for a while and what I've been failing to do is update my girlfriend's office setup just a little bit uh, to make it more you know, in tune with the rest of the office. So there's some weird things uh, about how she wants her setup done. For example, like this is a 4K 27 inch monitor and she doesn't want it. Um, she wants a 1080p monitor because the 4K one takes a lot more like uh, messing around with sometimes to get it working. Sometimes if you plug your computer in, it goes to the 4K resolution so everything is like super tiny and then you have to mess with the display settings and all that stuff. So she just wants to default down to a 1080 uh, monitor. So I picked one up right here. So we got a 1080 monitor for her. We got a desk uh, or a big mouse pad for her because right now for a mouse pad, she had a mouse pad here somewhere that was like a little piece of leather. So I got kind of like a big leather style looking one for the desk uh, and then got her a keyboard, got her a uh, phone stand thing. So basically we're gonna try to clean this office up a little bit and clean this up and give her a nice little setup that's gonna look really, really, really good. But kind of where we are right now with everything is there's a random shelf in the middle of the room. There is this shelf that I used to have in this corner, which used to have this stuff on it, but now it's all over here. So the first thing I'm gonna do is clean up this place a little bit because it's disgusting. So I'm gonna clean. Time lapse. Okay, it's a little cleaner in here, a little bit better. If you've watched the channel for a while, this is actually new. Uh, I wasn't gonna include this in part of the office setup, but I just wanted to get it out of the way because it was super dirty. Okay, so the first thing I wanna do is test out this, this new mouse pad that I got her. She's a uh, bigger fan about aesthetics than really anything else. So for her, it doesn't have to be the highest quality of anything. She really just wants it to look pretty, which is fine. So this is the new mouse pad, which actually looks fantastic in this area. I don't know why, is this a thing? That's just empty, I don't know what that's there. So yeah, new mouse pad actually looks freaking good. And then the other thing that I want to do is swap out that monitor for that one, because she doesn't want the 4K one anymore. So the only thing I really need to do to swap these two is take off the mount, because uh, this one did not come with one. So gotta get a screwdriver first, take that guy off. Okay, the 1080p monitor is in, the 4K one is gone. If anybody uh, wants to know about this 4K monitor, it's the same one that I have over there for my dual monitor setup. She also did not want a dual monitor. So these are the same ones that I have. 4K 27 inch Dell, really, really nice monitors, but she did not. She's not into the whole fancy setup. Oh shoot, she is not into the whole fancy setup thing. So. This is the beginnings. The other thing was I hooked her up with this super cool mechanical keyboard. It's a Blitzwolf something or another. Blitzwolf KB1 or something. Uh, it is very cool and I'll plug it in in a second to show you. The last thing for simple little upgrades, got her little phone stand because I don't know. I felt like working from home, she needed to have some sort of like cool, cool setup for her phone to go on. So yeah, she was cracking me up because I was like, are you sure you don't want like a double monitor? Are you sure you don't want your 4K monitors? She didn't want any of it. Uh, she just wanted 
the 1080p monitor, single one, and uh, she also has an older MacBook, so it has to work with HDMI, which this one does, so that's good for us. So I'm gonna hook this up to all the wires and we'll go from there. Okay, so it's hooked up. The cable management is just terrible, but that's fine. She's not she's not picky about that. I wasn't actually able to use the cable that came with the, the monitor because it was display port. It's right here. So that's just gonna go in like the box and into the closet where we'll never see it again. Get that out of the way. All right, so I'm not gonna connect the mic for now because I don't know if she actually wants it here, but for her like Zoom calls and stuff, uh, she'll have a better mic set up than most people I would assume. Now I don't actually know where her laptop is. She has like an older MacBook, uh, which doesn't have like USB-C, it only has HDMI. Uh, all right, so here's mine, here's my old one, we'll try this. Okay, so I did two things for her keyboard. The first is that I tied up this thing there because I don't know, I don't think she'll really care if that's all over the place, but I just wanted to make it look cleaner. Uh, and then the other one is I made sure to get her a keyboard that has arrow keys. So if you look, these have like arrow keys hidden and then like a shorter shift button. This Blitzwolf keyboard is actually fantastic. So I wish, I'm gonna get this charged up and then I'll show you guys what it looks like fully on. Okay, so her setup, finally done. Uh, we moved the foof chair back in here, so there's a little bit less room and it's still messy on the other, everywhere else in the room. Um, but for a full kind of like description of whatever whatever's going on here. So we got her a giant mouse pad. Uh, if you've never had a big mouse pad before, these are a game changer. Definitely check one of these out. Um, I got her the Blitzwolf KB1. And this is really cool because it is technically uh, a fuller size keyboard. It's like a 70% because it has uh, a little shift bar because it has actual arrow keys, which is super nice. 60% boards do not. So if I go over to this one, you can see like this one doesn't have arrow keys, but they're basically the same size. This is actually a little smaller, which is really cool. I prefer these ones over the 60%. Or that guy back there. That's a really cool keyboard too, by the way. Um, she has a 1080p monitor. Uh, it's a Dell monitor. I don't know the exact model, but all of this stuff will be in the description down below. Amazon links, affiliate, all that stuff. Uh, and then phone holder. This is more of like a quality of life thing. If you don't have a phone holder for your desktop space, uh, definitely get one. I don't know where my phone is. Get your phone, throw it sideways or whatever. And then when you sit down, you know, it's just kind of there ready to go. This is actually a sick view. We got a little bit of the RGB back there, a lot more underneath. Cable management is okay. There's only two down there that you can really see, so I don't mind. And I know for a fact she doesn't mind. Got her MacBook hooked up to the monitor. And of course gave her just like a little magic mouse. I think the magic mouse is fine. I actually use it every day for when I'm on my Mac. Uh, when I'm on my PC, I obviously use a different one, but magic mouse is actually a fantastic uh, option. And, uh, it is not hooked up to her computer. Okay, it turns out this mouse is actually dead. So we're just gonna hook up to a little charger here real quick. And then since this mouse was designed so well, I'm gonna plug it in the bottom and let that charge. But overall, I think this is a perfectly good setup. I really actually love this kind of like bezel-less monitor look going on here. I've never really seen one of those before compared to mine where it's like a one inch bezel. I think that this is a really great setup for just anybody. 1080p is perfectly fine, don't need 4K. And then yeah, for the mic, hooked her up with the AT2020 USB. 
they don't actually make this microphone anymore. This was, in my opinion, the best USB studio type microphone you could get. It was $100, it was a USB mic, and it sounds fantastic. They discontinued it though, so I don't know. I don't know, I don't, I'll, I'll link something similar in the description, something that I would say is comparable um, to this one. For my own setup, I use the Focusrite with the Rode Pod mic. Uh, but I literally think that this is on the same quality. If you really aren't somebody who's a, in the field of like audio, you would never know the difference between this and that setup over there. So, Haley, what? can you be on camera? Sure. Yeah? What do you need from me? I just want you to see it. She's gonna hate this color scheme. I'm gonna have to change that. This can change, by the way. We'll see first. So you've already seen it, but I just want to know like your own, because like this yeah. stuff has been sitting around forever. It has. It actually I looks. I wait for your video. I'm kind of jealous because on camera. It looks good. Your setup looks actually like way, like mine looks fine, but because it's all black, it just looks like a blob. Yeah, I've been Yours actually looks. To use this. It looks so nice. So, I mean, obviously like the mouse is like oh, charging. Oh, I haven't used this yet. I know the monitor is really like it's a, I genuinely am, 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 am like surprised at how well this comes off on camera because it just looks so good. It does. I'm gonna end the video. Hopefully that was cool. Hopefully you like her new office setup. I I'm genuinely like how this turned out. Like this is really cool, and we'll mess around with that because I know you probably don't like the color scheme. Yeah, I knew it. So all one color. You want all one color? I think. Wait, let's do that real quick. Ooh. Blue. Blue. A lighter Another blue. blue. <laughs> this setup looks so good on camera. I'm so happy this is what you chose. I'm gonna stick with pink. Wow. Which isn't really like Yeah, that's not. <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna end it here. Thank you so much for watching. All this stuff. Thank you for the update. All the stuff that uh, is here is gonna be in the description. Um, I love everything here. Even this mouse pad is super. I, everything's nice. It looks great. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one. Peace. Looks awesome. Do you want to say bye? <laughs>